This video was sponsored by Peachy's Cult who creates Animal Crossing cushions, more about them at the end of this video. Hey guys, and welcome back to another new Animal Crossing video. I'm Crossing Channel and today we'll be speculating, going over all the details we do know and more about the potential of cooking coming to Animal Crossing New Horizons in the near future. If you're excited for this video, be sure to leave a like, and if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe and turn on channel notifications for more Animal Crossing videos. Before we get into this, please bear in mind there will be some potential minor spoilers ahead for future updates, so keep that in mind before watching. Animal Crossing New Horizons was the first of the main games to introduce the new crafting feature, one that has been quite divisive amongst fans. Some people love it, some of us hate it, but there's no denying that crafting plays an important role in Animal Crossing New Horizons. We've seen them add a lot of new recipes as the game has gotten updated, but what if they added a new type of recipe, a cooking recipe? Well, this certainly seems like it could have a potential future update, what with the Harvest Festival coming on the 4th Thursday of November. The Harvest Festival is all about cooking and creating dishes for your villagers to enjoy it on a day, all about harvesting the natural resources from your island. Recently, New Horizons introduced a brand new feature with the Halloween update, which was farming. From data mines, we can see that the game will be including much more than just pumpkins as potential vegetables to grow, expanding to carrots, potatoes, sugar, wheat, and more. This definitely seems like it'd be perfect for the Harvest Festival, and these hidden additions have been in the game's code for quite a while now. But what would we actually do with them? Well, like with the pumpkins, maybe we could use them as pure resources to craft new DIY recipes like the spooky set, but I actually think these will be used to craft dishes that can be given to villagers, eaten for energy, or simply placed outdoors as a decoration. New Horizons has a weird lack of food items that you can display outside or indoors, which is unlike New Leaf that had a ton of really cool food items that they could have easily added from the get-go. This makes me believe that we'd do some kind of food related update, even if it's just them adding new food related DIY recipes for us to put on display rather than dishes we can actually cook. Either way, you could do a lot with the dishes that you can cook yourself. In Pocket Camp, you could feed special treats to your villagers and their friendship would go up with you a lot, so maybe that could happen here in New Horizons too. It'd certainly make getting those elusive photos a lot easier. They'd also be great to display outdoors, as many of us have made our own restaurants, cafes, and even bars where food could fit in perfectly. These could work very well indoors too, where food usually goes. Maybe instead of making a these with a DIY recipe bench, you'd get your own cooking stove, which is fairly typical of games with crafting elements like this. It'd probably work very similar to how we already collect DIY recipes and craft those, just with food ingredients instead of things like wood. It would certainly make farming more extensive too, as we'd have a wide variety of vegetables to grow which would really help you do more with the game, and even more so if they added extra elements to it like needing to water them every day or some kind of fertilizer which could give you better or more ingredients for you to craft with. It certainly seems like in late November we can expect to see our islands filled with food related items, but it's unknown yet whether this update will actually feature some kind of cooking update or just food related items related to the Harvest Festival. Either way, it's certain that we'll get quite a few new items with this update as we typically have done with all of the previous updates, so that's very exciting indeed, and I'm sure the Harvest Festival is going to be a lot of fun in this game. It'd be a lot of fun to get an update like this, and I'm sure very soon we'll see what this update has in store for us, so be sure to keep an eye out for that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'd love for you to tell me your thoughts on cooking in the comments section down below. Do you think cooking could come to Animal Crossing New Horizons? And if it does, what would you like to see, and how would you like to see it implemented in the game? Let me know down in that comment section below. Before we end off, I'd like to give a message from my sponsor. Are you tired of the same old pillows in your life? Tired of thinking, wow, that's kinda comfy, but it doesn't look like my favorite Animal Crossing villager. Well, be tired no more. Presenting to you, the Bob Pillow. This beautiful work of art was created by today's sponsor, Peachy's Colt. Peachy's Colt creates Animal Crossing pillows and cushions that you can cuddle up with if you so choose, and not only of Bob, you can get a pillow from them of any of your favorite villagers, from Barrel to Blabbers. So, if you're interested in shopping for the cutest pillow you've ever seen, check out the link in the description to get one yourself. Terms and conditions may apply. Pillow may be subject to extreme comfiness and may make you say, wow, that looks a lot like my favorite villager at least five times a day. If you want to help support the channel and get a whole bunch of cool perks for doing so, be sure to click the join button down below the video to become a member of the Bob's Gang. You can get a whole bunch of cool perks for doing so and it helps the channel out a whole bunch too. Thank you guys for watching this video, if you enjoyed be sure to leave a like, and you can also subscribe for even more Animal Crossing content. Be sure to check out more videos on the right side of the screen, and I'll catch you in the next one.